Kuna throws it in. It's a long one where Brazier collects. Brazier with that fantastic left foot step. What can you do about that? She's a magician, isn't she? Kelly Brazier. Yeah, nothing you can do about that, really. And she had a player on her shoulder as well, so the poor defender's trying to defend one of the best steps in world rugby and the second player. Here she goes. It's just poetry in motion, that step. Twice. Twice off the left foot and in under the post. Gets the support of Yamaguchi on that far side, but New Zealand opting to kick through Brazier <laughs> this time. McAllister, well, she didn't think about chasing it and eventually goes for it. And McAllister inside is Brazier. Well, Brazier started the movement and she finishes the movement. New Zealand dominant against Japan in this opening half. She says a tough try, she's a hard woman, Kelly Brazier. She saw numbers to the left-hand side, she says, sorry, Kayla. She kicked it down and Kayla just got back from the last place. That takes a lot of fitness levels to do that. Kayla said, oh, well, if you're going to do that, you can run all the way to and finish it, Kelly. McAllister, McAllister just probes. Look at the hard yards she got there. No! Well, England MTM. came in, Brazier, sharp, starts to attack. Claire Allen bundled into the turf, and Kelly Brazier, she'll back herself. Kelly Brazier, brilliant awareness from the New Zealand playmaker. Well, she was like a puppeteer. Kelly Brazier's Ruby Two is about to come on for Portia Woodman. The way she was playing with the England defence, you can't turn your back against a stepper like Kelly Brazier. Otherwise, she will rip you to shreds. But Brazier, just pure skill. Look at that, just eye up to the fence, just lull them into a sense of security. You see that you turn your back and you can't do that. Emily Scott for England, she was on the back foot. Step, she did well to offload it because there was no support around. Now they've got some holes. Oh, classic step. Kelly Brazier off the left foot. She's gonna have to go all the way to fix Kelter is coming to get her. She has to use the throw with, but Kelly Ramsey takes the lead from New Zealand. Phenomenal try from a top playmaker there. But again, you were saying, having that point about coming out of the line, trying to look that big hit, and sort of that, it's mean that space is just opening up left, right, and center in USA's defense. And even then, there, just didn't know how to commit. She didn't throw a body into it, and sort of that, that big powerful step from Brazier just left the space to open up for it. Brazier, Brazier. Brazier will just get there despite the attempted cover tackle from Grassano. And that might be a telling strike in the shadows of halftime. Key score there for Kelly Brazier. Kelly Brazier has been very good so far in Dubai, as I mentioned before. She's very balanced off both feet. She's been playing since she was two years old. One tip over the top. This is good, but five tries against the cross. Yesterday evening, top try scorer here this weekend. She scored tries in each and every match that the uh, Ferns have played. Lovely step there from Kelly Brazier. One, two, and over. Good work by uh, the Otago representative, just her fourth event here. Well, she's uh, known as a, a hot stepper, which was hot to trot there, wasn't she? Beautiful twinkle toes. She did create this at the end herself, didn't she? Two left foot steps. Going straight through, haven't seen too much of her today with the ball in hand. Cox Edge. That was to uh, Tofata. There's Brazier. Brazier looking for a hat trick. She might well get it here. Brazier from the line through two tackles. Superb performance from the fullback. Kelly Brazier makes it three. That's four tries to New Zealand. Good run through there from Mariana Manuel as well. Setting up, creating the momentum eventually for Kelly Brazier to pop up. Beautiful. Now lost, hands out! Christian Dane, Aroha, the Māori is love. And there's no love shown here from the New Zealanders who go on the attack through Natua. Up to Matau. 
New Zealand captain can't handle it, but they've still got possession. Now Brazier puts down the hammer. Kelly Brazier. Brazier into the backfield. Brazier looking for some support. Doesn't need it. Kelly Brazier scores one of the great tries of the Rugby World Cup of 2017. Individual brilliance. She just wound her way through all of the defense. I think one, two, three, four defenders that she beat. She didn't need to look for her support. She took the ball under her right hand and made her way to the right hand side of the post and then just swerved back a little bit closer to the post because I think to make it a little bit easier for Co Coxage, really, really nice. It's just lovely. So close to the line for Brazier. Finish off what she started. Yes, she can. Individual. Brilliant. Oh, Tell you what, we've seen some brilliant individual breaks in this tournament so far today, but that is the best by a long way. She's side footed, not one, not two, but three United States defenders. Look at that beautiful quick beat and the awareness to know where she was. And look at it for a finish over the head. Bang. And she's come on as Hope Rogers. Jeanette to Rosier throws the pass. It's got a board advantage for Advantage. New Zealand. And now Advantage. out to Brazier. Woodman is outside Brazier, but Brazier's got lovely footwork. Kelly Brazier does the impossible. New Zealand at 40. The footwork from Kelly Brazier was Ginger Rogers like. Well, Brazier has waited until the 76th minute to show us what she's got because she's just as potent at attacking as any other member of her team. That left-footed step twice, wrong-footed the defence, and then she straightened up and used her pace to go through. Brazier has been brilliant today.